morning, guys. Just a little video, really. Um, I get this asked this question so much in my comments. Um, what's the best shift pattern to work on Uber? And I always respond. I always respond with, it depends on the individual. It depends on the person. Depends on uh, the routine of their family, their life. Um, there's pros and cons of any shift pattern. If you want to go for pure money, you can't miss Friday, Saturday nights. You just can't. Um, the morning rush hours are good. The afternoon rush hours are good because you get your peak rate. Don't forget on Uber, peak rate is 7 till 9, Monday to Friday. Um, 3 till 6 p.m., Monday to Thursday. And then Friday, 1 p.m., through to Sunday midnight. They're the, they're the peak rates. So obviously, if you work during the peak rates, you gotta obviously you get better per mile. But for the week peak rates, you got loads of traffic to deal with. And day drivers will go. Can't believe those night drivers. They work at nights. How do they deal with the drunk people? How do they deal with all the rubbish? And then all the night drivers are going to the day drivers. But how are they dealing with the traffic? How boring because it's slower and all that. You know what I mean? There's so many variables. You just gotta get out and try on what on what's best for you uh, and the situation. Myself personally, I'm always drawn to days because my wife and kids are normally busy during the day, so I can work and then I can see my wife and kids of a weekend, um, yeah, of a, of a, obviously a weeknight, and then the weekends I'll either go out dead early in the morning or do a night shift, a couple of hours kip. I can have the weekend with the family then, so. <clears throat> It does, it literally depends on the person, on the situation. Um, what I've been doing at the moment, I've been doing Monday to Thursday split shifts. Um, so I do anywhere between 5 and 9 a.m. Monday to Friday. And I do go back out like two and, between 2 and 7, Monday to Thursday. And then Friday I'll go out about 1, because the peak rate go out about 1. And then sometimes work till whenever, 7, 8, 9, 10, midnight, whatever. Whatever, need the money. And then I'll have the Saturday day off. And then I'll probably wear, I normally work either the Saturday night or get up early and get and do the Sunday morning slash day shift. All depend on what I'm doing, what situation I'm on. Now, when I've got to do the school runs, all that routine changes. This is the whole point of me being on the taxis, is the flexibility of the taxis. I can change my shift pattern when needed. Next week, my wife's um, in Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, long eight, 12 hour days. So that means I'm gonna have to work Thursday, Friday, Saturday, the air shifts, but overnight. As soon as she comes in, I'm high fiving it and going to, going to work. But what I'm gonna try and do is I'm gonna try and make those four nights my only nights I'm gonna work next week. So I'm gonna work right through and just kill it. So then the three days that she's got off, I've got off. Same again, you've got to play around and does whatever's best for you. Because I've got over 100 videos on this channel now, guys. And I still get comments from my first, second, third videos. And they're all the same. What's the best shift pattern on Uber? Uh, how much can you earn on Uber? I get this all the time. How much can you earn on Uber? Literally, it's unanswerable. Do you know what I mean? I went out this morning, two hours. I've only been out two hours, went out thought go and get a little break with the family but I'll go out and do a couple of hours before they all wake up right prime example I went out two hours one of the lads there has done 15 quid it is very quiet out I've done 55 literally dead lucky I let you motorway like boom down there picked up there tricked up there back down there 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 55 quid two hours smashed it one of the other lads is on like 13 quid for two hours or something stupid like that Um, it is purely Look, you just cannot predict it. Do you know what I mean? It it can be up and down. The past two weeks on Uber's been awful. It's been really quiet. Um, so yeah, it, it's the, yeah, the questions are so hard to answer because with the taxis, it's preference. It's what car you drive. It's what situation you're in. Have you got wife and kids? I know a lad who's got no family and he just does constant nights. Cleans up, cleans up. Six p.m. Two, three, four in the morning, seven days a week, cleans up, mate. Cleans up. 
because she's got no commitments. I couldn't do that because I'd never see my wife and kids. Do you know what I mean? So, it is very situational, the taxis. But, if you want a standard, good, solid um, shift pattern, first of all, what you prefer, days or nights. If you go on days, I'd avoid 10 a.m. till 2 p.m. It is awful. Do split shifts if you're going on days midweek. And then the weekends are generally busy, generally all over the weekend. So just do whatever you want, whenever you can. Uh, if you want to go for the money and you need the big money, you have to work Friday, Saturday night. Got to. Um, got to, at least a Saturday. You've got to. Um, and then obviously generally nights. Nights are busier because there's no traffic. So you can actually fly between jobs. And obviously it's a lot busier because everyone's a lot more active. Days can be very hit and miss. But if you stick to around the peak rates, the school run times, it is busy. But um, same again, it is preference, guys. So hopefully whoever you watch this video and you can stop asking me this type of question. <laughs> no, all jokes aside. Yeah. So if you want to know how much you're in on Uber, go and sign up to Uber and work it. Yeah. If you want to know what's the best shift pattern, go out and try the shift pattern. What works best for you may not work best for me. Do you know what I mean? Different cities have different routines, different areas have different ways of working. You've literally got to go out and work it and test it yourself, guys. All right? I hope you enjoyed this little video today. I'm going to go in and eat me brekkie, chill the family, and I'll catch you at the next one, guys, yeah? Make sure you give us a big thumbs up, like, subscribe, and all that jazz. And obviously, feel free to comment below, as long as it's nothing to do with what's the best time to work on, are you, Matty? <laughs> nice one, guys. Catch you later.